Good morning, everyone. Um, I'm coming at you nice and fresh faced um, <laughs> in my pajamas, nonetheless. Um, yeah, it's it's 9.30 and I'm still in my pajamas. I'm actually between phone calls. Um, I came in my kitchen to, <clears throat> excuse me, I have a horse in my, I have a frog in my throat because I've been sick like the past three days. So it's been like, uh. um, anyway, I came in my kitchen to um, pour myself another glass of delicious coffee because if you know me, you know I run on two things, coffee and wine. Um, so my morning time is my coffee and it occurred to me that um, there might be like a slew of people out there who don't know about the magic that happens when you put coffee through our magic decanter. So this is that aerator that you use on red wines. It not only works for wine, but it also works for coffee. So it's gonna take the bitterness out of your coffee like completely. And if you have a little bit of milk in there, it's gonna kind of make it latte-esque. I mean, it's not gonna turn it into a latte, but it's gonna kind of aerate it through there um, and, and really kind of turn it into a little bit of a latte. Um, so I thought I'd just pop on here really quick and show everyone um, the versatility of this amazing little doodad. So here I am. I have my coffee cup and I'm just going to go ahead and put some milk in here, right? So I'm just going to like, just because I like just an itty bitty bit of milk <clears throat> in my coffee. Otherwise, I just like let it black, okay? Um, okay, so I have a little bit of milk in my coffee and I'm gonna get my pot. Um, so if you're like me and you buy cheap coffee at Aldi, <laughs> uh, this is perfect because it will make it taste like, you know, you bought Folgers or I don't know, something more expensive. I don't, I don't know what the coffees are because I just buy the cheap stuff. Um, at any rate, okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this and we're gonna put it just like you would do a glass of wine, right? So put it in through the aerator. You're not going to burn the aerator or melt the aerator in any capacity. Um, sometimes people think that they're going to like burn the aerator or like melt it with hot coffee. It would take a lot, I mean it would take like molten lava to melt this puppy, okay? You're not gonna hurt it with coffee. Um, but yeah, so there you go. So now, <clears throat> put that back over there. So now we have my nice steaming hot cup of coffee and it tastes mm, so delicious. It's amazing. So I hope everyone has one of these little um, magic decanters. This is our aerator that I um, always bring with me to my tastings. I use for my red wines to um, get that immediate gratification with your red wine um, so you don't have to like let it sit in a decanter for like hours on end. No one has time for that. So um, anyway, um, this is our magic decanter. It's normally $29.99. Um, if you buy a case of wine, which is 12 bottles, you actually get it for 87% off. It's only $7 if you buy a case of wine. So that's like a phenomenal deal. It's my number one accessory that I sell. And it's so versatile. You can use it on red wine. You can use it on coffee, <clears throat> like you just saw me, saw me do. You can also use it on beer. So if you are a beer drinker or if you have beer drinkers in your family, um, you can pour a bottle or a can of beer through it just in the same way that I did with the coffee. Um, you may want to rinse it out after using the coffee though. Um, and it would make the bottle or canned beer taste like it came from the tap. So if you prefer like beer from the tap, I know lots of people do, um, <clears throat> you can pour the can or the, the bottle through this and it will make it taste like it came from the tap. So it's such a versatile little dude. Um, and it's, it's fun to have around the house, um, to really like impress your friends if that's what you like to do. Anyway, I hope everyone has a fantastic day. Happy Wednesday. It's wine Wednesday. Um, so, um, also hump day, but I hope everyone has a fantastic day.